So I've finished uh, building a Lynx Motion Johnny 5 and um, a couple of the servos are um, making a kind of whining noise when they're, um, well, all the time really. It's in the base rotate and the first servo and the second servo and the torso. Now those two, latter two are under, under like a lot of strain from the body of the robot but I've taken the base rotate out and the servo itself isn't whining until you put it in with the, the top on the base rotate and with the screw in and it's, it's when it's holding a position and I've made another video of that um, so I got these cheap Chinese servos, they're about six dollars which is dirt cheap, a metal gear and they're supposed to be about 13 kilograms of torque per centimetre put one of these in the base rotate and uh, it's not whining in holding position so I'm not sure about this whether Lynx Motion aren't using a high enough torque servo or I've just got a dodgy high tech servo I don't know but I'll show you this now anyway okay there's the base rotate this is just moving the slider on the SSC32 software to move the servo you see when it gets to its full extent the servo does have a bit of jitter but I notice some of the high tech ones do that anyway but yeah you can see it's not holding it's holding position and it's not making a whining noise taken it apart, had a look at the metal gears they look alright, I can't really tell but it looks fairly well built to me I mean for six dollars you can't really complain, I don't know how long it will last but we shall see I only ordered one of these Chinese servos I think I just told a lie in the earlier part of the video or the other video and so I got several, I haven't, I bought one in the base rotate it is now, I'm going to take it out of the base rotate and pop it into Johnny 5 who's kind of disassembled over there and see if it gets rid of the hum in the lower torsos hmm. I've lost some screws I found some screws put the high tech uh, servo, I think it's a HS485BB back in the base rotate and as you can hear there's a bit of hum again it's not too bad but I haven't tightened the screw that goes into it, I have no idea why that affects it it really shouldn't but um, yeah it just depends on the position it's in I think it's just uh, the server is just not good enough power some positions it doesn't know that position moved too dead that it's reached its position it should be in so it stopped humming but this is without the Johnny 5 torso on which is obviously going to add uh, more stress to it so. That position doesn't harm. That one doesn't. That one does. Oh, it stopped. Oh, it stopped. Let's we'll see what it's like with the uh, torso on. Done. That was quick. Johnny Five is alive. And as you can hear, the servos are humming. Noisy. Um, I've put the cheap Chinese servo in position number one which is the lowest in the torso and I've put, well I've just left the high tech uh, HS645MG in position number two uh, the second one up on the torso um, it is the Chinese one that's making most of the humming but uh, when I turn number two off, the high tech one, I've only got these two activated at the minute when I turn number two off, the high tech one it actually stops the uh, number one, the Chinese one, from humming um, I'm just holding the uh, torso up with my fingers I will show you, kind of like that I'm not actually taking any of the weight, I'm just holding it so, I don't know, I don't know, I'm wondering if one of the, prob the problems is spring related whether these aren't tight enough, but I will show you what happens That's the Chinese servo that's humming, and that's the high-tech one which is also humming but slightly less. 
uh, I need to put the camera down.